Let's open up the cookie mail cookies. Hello everyone, welcome to Food Review UK, my name's MJ and today we are reviewing the Cookie Mill Easter cookies. So, got some information on the back here. The Easter Mixed Box, limited editions of our Easter flavours. Wow. As always with the Cookie Mill, you get the packaging that you open into. Slight change on the Cookie Mill, Rich has started charging for shipping, which is fair enough because it was costing him a hell of a lot of money. Um, the classic insert there and we've got three flavours here all of these Easter flavours are stuffed with an entire egg, chocolate egg oh man look at this these look sick so we have got cookies and cream a whole Cadbury's Oreo egg stuffed inside an Oreo flavoured cookie we have got, I know what this one is the You're So Creamy a whole Cadbury's cream egg stuffed inside a deep dish cookie. And last but by no means least, we've got nuts about Easter. This is a whole Reese's egg inside a cookie with Reese's pieces. I'm going to save that one for last. The one I'm actually going to do first is the Cadbury cream egg. Because I've sort of had a preview of this cookie already. Oh. If you've never had a uh, cookie meal cookie, then get on it. They obviously look like this, very thick, and you can see sort of the, the uh, egginess on the bottom. Right, here we go. I don't mean egginess, I mean you can see where the egg is. <laughs> Absolute filth. Right. It's sweet, it's buttery, it's rich. Yeah. And the Cadbury flavour is amazing on this, I, I absolutely love this one. Oh man. Honestly, seriously, that's an entire cream egg inside a Rich's cookie. Cookie more cookie, I mean. Oh. So it's chewy, crispy on the outside, and then basically, it's like a, just a chocolate bar in the middle. I don't want to be biased to Rich, but he keeps making products that are like six stars. Right, now I'm going to try the cookies and cream. <coughs> Very intrigued to try this one. I think I'm going to absolutely go mental over the Reese's one. Uh, right, so this is a Cadbury Oreo egg inside of an Oreo flavour cookie. Oh man. Oh, the, the chocolatey smell in there is amazing. Right, here we go. Mmm. Oh wow. Nice and sweet. And it's that really nice sweet chocolate flavour. So it's not strong chocolate. It's not like a normal chocolate cookie. I mean, you can see that just from looking at it anyway. This one is harder than the cream egg one. It's not so much of a soft filling. It's like a creamy, harder filling. Oh, wow. You get extra crunch from the Oreo egg. Bit of crunch. The crispy bits of the Oreo in there. Mmm. This one's good. Nice chewiness on the cookie. Looks like that in the middle. Yeah. Key thing on that one is it is mega sweet and sweety chocolatey. I don't think the egg works as well in that one. It's a little bit harder. I think it works better with the softer filling. But they're still really tasty. I'll give it five stars. Right. Oops. This is the one that went it, realistically. Nuts about Easter. <laughs> right. Oh, right, here we go. Oh, man, you can see the shards of Reese's Pieces on there. Here we go. Oh my god. Mm. Yeah. It's Rich's intense buttery, delicious cookie with sweet and strong peanut butter flavour. That classic Reese's taste comes through it. It's like very identifiable as Reese's peanut butter. Oh, that's mega. That's what it looks like in the middle of the cookie. She wants to be in the middle. She wants to be in the middle of us. That's not quite as good as the Uzi, um, what was it? Nuts About You, I think it was called, the Valentine's um, peanut butter one, because that had a softer peanut butter in the middle, but they're still 
insane. I think I'd have a hard time choosing between the Reese's one and the cream egg one. I'd give out six stars. Mm. God damn delicious. Another interesting thing about the cookie mail. <clears throat> if you've never tried these cookies, try them, they're insane. If you want more information, we should also say Rich is a friend of ours. Uh, that doesn't affect the reviews. I give him an honest review because a lot of people say, oh, of course you're going to give him a good review, he's your friend. Well, what happens if I give him a good review and it's a bad product and you buy it and you're like, oh, it's crap. Just, just don't take my word for it. Look at the reviews on his website. He's also upgrading soon. So at the moment he's selling out every time he restocks. Um, he's he's going to have more capacity to be able to cook um, cookies soon. So um, hopefully it will dramatically increase his output so there will be less people disappointed with the sellouts. But yeah, wicked. Thank you very much for watching everyone. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did and you're new, please subscribe for more. And hey, why don't you give this video a like, a thumbs up. Cheers guys.